Asalaamu Alaikum everyone, welcome to today's um, you know, Jasmine video update and so far we are live and kicking with Jasmine and it's been a, a heck of a ride with Jasmine. I'm loving the moves of, the, of Jasmine and so far I love the fact that I've been predicting Jasmine absolutely perfectly back to back. Now what is going on with Jasmine I'm going to tell you in a while. Before that I do want to mention that if you want to learn trading and TA the course is there, the link is in the description of the video. Do check it out or just join the Discord for free. It's absolutely free for, from here. Right, now, uh, two, three days ago, I was making a critical update, the second part of Jasmine. I even posted on the Discord that uh, there is a falling wedge for Jasmine on the four hour time frame and potentially a bull flag, which is uh, looking to go to the upside over there. But yesterday, I also talked about the fact that you might see Jasmine uh finding resistance at these levels and potentially make a double top like this this first top and this is the second top right there so what you want to see is that you break out of this place go to the 49 come back to hold the 44 like this and then you slowly continue to go to the upside so there is there might be a little bit of an issue uh, if you start to make a double top because that's not good at all and yes jasmine has been way overextended but um, nonetheless you cannot ignore the fact that you also put a bull flag right there so who knows you might still come down here make a double bottom like this so it's gonna be boom boom make a nice big huge w and then you continue because even if you in the future you come down here to this level to the 318 you still haven't invalidated the bull flag do you get my point here because if you the only way to invalidate the bull flag is uh, if you potentially start to roll over, lose the 23 and lose this yellow line at the 20 and then you go even more down, then this is not in play anymore. That three white soldier is not in play anymore. And uh, I, do, I do expect this week to be uh, bullish because on the weekly we are bullish, by the way. So be careful on this space right there, uh, as I said yesterday. So I'm going to dive into the daily as well. Now, the daily time frame, uh, we do have a potential three white soldier but the thing is that this candlestick today has not been confirmed now when you see these candles i do want to turn on the volume and the problem with jasmine is that there is a there's one issue here and i'm gonna be telling you this because it's important you're having a, something known as volume divergence here when the prices are moving up like that and then the volume goes down like this that's known as a volume divergence, okay? And that's bearish. That's not good. That's not a good sign. Uh, for example, uh, down here, you didn't have any volume divergences, okay? And during these candlesticks, you can see the volumes are actually equal to one another, okay? But right now, the volume are not equal. Even though the candlestick is equal, this was equal, but you can see the volume is dropping. This one is dropping. This has a big green candle. The volume is not even there. So there's a little bit of an issue and there's a possibility of making a double top here. And uh, this might not play or uh, this still didn't play, by the way. As I, as I told you before, you, you could still come down here and go up again and making a double bottom right, right there. Okay. So we're going to talk about that one in the future, but today is a little bit shady. Today is a little bit of uh, shadiness going on, okay? So the, the candlestick closes in the next 14 hours, okay? But still, nonetheless, if things do get bullish once again, you uh, this one is not going to play any more importance. It doesn't still mean that this is confirmed, going to tell you to go down, but it's something to pay attention to because when you have divergences like this, that's not a good sign. The price go up, volume drops, then there's a dump that can happen actually all of a sudden out of nowhere. So you got to be careful in that space. That's the only thing that I want to actually put into for you into mind because at the end of the day, all I'm doing is chart reading and uh, all the possibilities of, uh, of a coin to do is something that I'm going to mention. You have a bull flag right here. Boom, you're breaking out of it. Yes, you're still looking technically you're looking to go there. Technically, you are on a journey to go there. But on the short term frame, you might have a little bit of a dump because of that volume divergence. Still, it doesn't mean that uh, you might not go there in the future. That's why I'm saying that if you do dump, calm down here, make a double bottom, and then boom, 
first bottom, second bottom. It's just a uh, speculation at this point of time, of course. And we still got to see the daily. You want to cross this level, hold it, back test it, and then you continue to the upside. So if you're in profits, always take your profits. Consider taking up a little bit of the profits as well. And that's it for the update. If you like the analysis here, even more about volume and how to trade do, uh, with volumes, then uh, guys, you do want to take the trading course here. You can check the video and what you're about to learn. And I'm going to see you in the next one. Allah Hafiz.